Hi, I'm Danielle Dangleman. Today we're going to talk about the Volusia Forever program. I am the Volusia Forever coordinator. Back in 2000, the voters approved the Volusia Forever program to tax themselves 0.2 mills in order to protect Volusia County's natural diversity and landscape. Volusia Forever partners with federal, state, and local entities in order to increase the properties in Volusia County that could be put into conservation. The state, federal, and local government has provided 35% of the fundings in order to do this. Hi, my name is Cindy and I'm the Volusia County Land Manager. Here at Land Management, we work to restore and protect our natural areas. With Volusia Forever, we manage approximately 40,000 acres with seven preserves being open to the public. With these preserves being located throughout the county, we have a variety of land management activities that we utilize. Some of these activities include prescribed burning, mechanical management, timber management, reforestation, and trail maintenance. Right here in Lyonia Preserve. It's a gorgeous day. Behind me is 360 acres of amazing scrub habitat. The scrub habitat is super important to local species like our Florida scrub jays and our gopher tortoises. We also have three different hiking trails out here, all the way down from half a mile all the way up to two and a half miles, just about. So you kind of get to pick your pace. What's so special about this land? Well, this land is actually a section 16 land. What does that mean? Way, way back in the day, lands were divided up into parcels. These parcels at every 16th one, they were gonna be dedicated to education, awareness, and the preservation of nature. So that's something that makes this area in Lyonia Preserve so special. You can also find out here native species such as Florida rosemary, sand live oak, saw palmetto, Let's go back to those animal species I was talking about, right? The Florida scrub jay. Maybe you've heard the Florida scrub jay go along with scrub habitat. You know, this Florida scrub jay is Florida's only endemic bird species. What does endemic mean? That's kind of a big word. Well, endemic means it's only found here. You can only come to scrub habitat to find our Florida scrub jay. And they are these beautiful blue birds. Our juveniles are gonna be a little bit more gray in color but they're awesome. They are cooperative breeders. Do we know what cooperative breeders are? That kind of means that the young stick around for another couple years to help raise the next group. They're super smart animals. What they do is they will hide up to 3,000 acorns and they remember where each one is, which is amazing. I can't even remember where I left my keys half the time. So they also don't like to travel that far from home. You know, some people are more homebodies, so they stick sort of in the same areas where they grew up. Another awesome thing, I mentioned this is scrub habitat. How do we know that it's scrub habitat? Well, it's characterized by this really cool sand. It's called sugar sand. It means it's super fine. It's like sugar. Creative, right? I know. What's really cool about this land is this used to be the ancient beach. Yes, I know, right in the middle of Florida? That's crazy. What do you mean this was the beach? Long, long time ago, millions of years ago, this used to be the shoreline. And you know that because all these sort of hills behind me used to be the sand dunes and the beach with the sugar sand around me. But that means that this area is kind of in short demand now because as sea levels rise, it's really popular for development. Okay? It, because it's high up and it's dry. So there are these important lands where our gopher tortoises and scrub jays live. They're shrinking, which is why we need to preserve areas such as this. But I hope you come out and join me. It's a beautiful day, and I can't wait to see you out here.